Oh wow. <laughs> it already started. Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Renardo, but you guys can call me Renimations, and you are joining me for a very long series. I don't know why I was looking at the mic girl away in the distance, but I was right there. Thank you all for joining me for this wonderful video. Uh, like I said, my name is Renardo, and you guys can call me Renimations. And you're joining me for a very long series where I make a 15 minute drawing every single day. And today's video of the day will be MXR and like Genie from MXR with Panda. I'm hoping I can get done as much as possible, even if it's like really stylized, like super stylized drawing, and get it done under the 15 minute period. If not, I'll spend an extra t uh, an extra amount of time on a separate video. Uh, like I'll upload this one and then like the very next video after that I done done what I had to do for uh, like my daily duties for today because you know everybody got things to do on a day to day basis so I done done doing those things I'll come back finish it off and then uh, upload it because I don't want a repetition of the PewDiePie video that look more like me than PewDiePie but I think I realized why that happened Anyways, thank you all for joining me, and hopefully you guys like it. Let me bring my screen a little bit lower, uh, lower into the side. I don't want it to be in the way of anything that you guys are going to be watching. So let's get started. First, and test out my brushes, because I, I want a good sketching brush, but <laughs> for some odd reason, uh, I actually probably I could do, I use this one, yeah, like I did for the burger. Gotta sneeze. <coughs> oh. oh, that's disgusting. Ugh. Some of it get on my tablet. Oh. Um. Where where is it? Timer. I got a new timer uh, in the previous video. I didn't have this. Let's get started. Let me think what I could have in mind. Maybe Genie in this side. Uh, obviously, her neck and stuff. And then the panda will be a very rounded shape. Maybe it's like looking off to the side or something. So. And Genie's just like that. Uh, very stylized Genie. Uh, I don't want to go into too much detail uh, with her. I'm actually looking to the side every once in a while to make sure my proportions are somewhat uh, more accurate than uh, the last time I did PewDiePie where I was not able to look at it because when I was trying to draw him I would do this thing where oh, this, that seems kind of off maybe hmm, that works it's gonna be very rough where uh, when I was trying to draw PewDiePie I did this thing where it, it just like I did it, I had all the pictures in this side where it, where my brushes are now Oh, what the heck? That was weird. I think I lifted up my uh, my pen, uh, stylus and then all of a sudden it just went crazy. I want her eyes to look a little bit more kind of like super happy about it. So I want to erase some of it, bottom portions of it, and just like Squint them up a little more. Erase and erase and erase and erase. And then squint. Not too much because then it looks like she has a black eye or something. Which obviously, I do not want to do off that illusion. <laughs> what else? Uh, she got very, eh, like, thick, eh, like, very noticeable jawline right here. Uh, Maybe I'll make this wider. 
Oh, it's got to be like really yeah, wide or something like that. And it's be really happy. So, right lower. And that. Let's see. And we like uh, I think cheekbones stuff that's too uh that's too long. Maybe something like that. It kinda looks like a Rick and Morty character. <laughs> Cause I haven't added any hair or anything like that. She looks kinda skinny, maybe it's just me. In my drawing. Needs to look like she has a much wider face. I'm gonna uh, delete all this really quickly. Uh, draw the like, shape of her face more like that. Not too much though. Uh, I, I'm readjusting it because I, I, I didn't like it. Of course, I would not suggest this if you're trying to do a, a, do a very detailed drawing in the very little time. Uh, yeah, that seems more like her uh, the overall shape um, uh, that I wanted. Get across. Uh, what else? The hair first. That's gonna be kind of like wrapping around. <laughs> and her. That could be right there. It's gotta be in her ears like this. It's usually like low. So I uh, like her, her hair is kind of flat. She doesn't have curly hair, so that's a plus. I don't have to draw very stylized curly hair. You know. Takes me time. And I have her hair covering her ear because, you know, time. Take maybe have her shirt and do this sort of thing. Uh, it's in this in the corner. Uh, eyebrows. Yeah, we find some of it. I want. Some of the main features to, uh, to stand out. Uh, uh, yeah, it's actually looking a lot better. Obviously, I want the panda to be very obvious. So maybe panda somewhere here. Shape of a panda's head would be pretty big, I would assume. Uh, not uh, the nose and everything. Maybe that. Shade all that here also because of perspective. Uh, the ears, obviously. Ears are also dark. Uh, this other ear is just gonna be up against her. And I want his uh, eyes to be like right there. Something. Because he's very stylized. Uh, well, stylized is <laughs> I personally think that uh, when someone says stylized for uh, for some drawings, they uh, they just mean a uh, less uh, less detailed version of my usual drawings. <laughs> but you know, that's just me. I don't know how this thing sounds. Oh, uh, oh, that's awesome! I can actually see the time up there. It says I got like seven minutes or something. Yeah, seven minutes. Not bad.
I thought for a second I had like less time than that. I just add like very f uh, like rough outlines so you can tell that it has hair make sure to uh, to give it cheeks by adding the hair like that and the form uh, what else I want I, I want her uh, kind of body to twist towards the panda because the like if she's hugging it, I'm gonna just instead of uh, the usual one, I'm just gonna use the card eraser, erase some of this hair and everything. I thought I had just put it in. Let's see if this, yeah, this one's bigger. I'm gonna use this brush, and she's just gonna be looking at it really quickly, like you should, like I said, and then go back to this brush. And her, her, her body's gonna be twisted more towards it. And I don't want, uh, I don't want to do some of the details for the hands. So I'm just gonna pretend that it just gets covered up by fur. And also another. Uh, rough patch over here because that's where her other hand will be at. The bear's ar uh, arm. And obviously all of this is dark so really quickly pass it with a dark shade for it off. And you know I want to make sure that you can tell uh, what's going on here? He loves pandas so much. Kind of like if she was hugging Henry. <laughs> and then do, uh, do some of the details with a smile. Nostrils. She's looking kind of upwards. <laughs> Go back to the hair because uh, we, yeah, we took off some of that hair. Obviously, it gets lighter over here. There you go, over here. Uh, if you look at the reference pictures, it's like it's dark, but then she likes to have highlights uh, for her hair. So I'm gonna essentially go from a very dark very light really quickly by just turn, uh, like pressing very lightly over some of it and then getting harder uh, and harder where, uh, where I press then I'm just gonna press really really light and soft for some of it right here but then obviously you do like somewhat rough passes off there Now it just looks like the, uh, you know, have like the bear's paw kind of like holding her, holding on to her too. And since it's all dark, it's gonna have it be like that. All that is dark. So now we have the bear having his paws holding her really quickly. Genie fan art right there. Or MXR fan art. I don't know. I'm doing it a different direction. 
just to show that that's where it ends, sort of thing. And I want her body to be like that. So it's more noticeable that this is in front. Okay. <laughs> I think the panda should be slightly more sharpier than what it is than what I portrayed them to be. Him or her, it doesn't matter. You know? She didn't say she likes male pandas said she likes pandas or did she say it doesn't matter right voila and obviously i want to put some clothes on genie uh, how much time do i have like less than one minute uh let's put on short sleeves or something like that and shade it really soft For her shirt, I'm just going one direction. It kind of gives the illusion that it's just one and different things to the panda. And I'm just going over it. Surprisingly, this ended up a lot better than the PewDiePie drawing. Okay. It's because I could see it in the corner of my eye right here compared to the PewDiePie. So I just had it. Yeah, so for the PewDiePie one, I just like went back to my usual way of drawing where I just like tend to draw an uh, accent to my face. <laughs> it's weird. Uh, I, I, it's not like I intend to draw my face, but I tend to draw my face. At the I saw it, uh, I was like, Wow, that looks a lot more like me and that, and that PewDiePie. Uh, that's so weird. Uh, yeah. Oh. You guys can't hear that, but I can hear it. And you did see that little... Oh, wait, I saw it. It popped up in my other screen. <laughs> that's the timer. Uh, oh, my ears. Oh. My ears are so warm now because I had the headset on. I'm not sure if they're red, actually. Uh, so yeah, that's my genie, uh, genie, and a panda fan art drawing. If you guys do want me to.